Uh, Carmel is the latest city to consider allowing open alcohol outside in certain parts of the city's downtown. News aide's Danielle Zakowski was at the city council meeting to hear people's concerns. A DORA or a designated outdoor refreshment area would allow people in Carmel to take a drink from inside of a bar and restaurant and walk around outside with it within the boundaries of the district as long as it was in a specific cup. The proposed boundaries include 1st Street Northwest as the boundary on the north, 4th Avenue Southwest and 3rd Avenue Southwest on the west. West Carmel Drive is the southernmost point and it extends to Executive Drive on the east. Well, it brings in more tax revenue. Um, that's, that's one thing. Think about many of the people that own condos on the Monon that spend many evenings at Saver or the Goat or anywhere else in Carmel and it would be nice if they could instead of having to chug their beer before they leave, just be able to walk home with it. There is concern among the two residents who spoke about the proposal publicly. I'd like to know why do this, how, ben how residents will benefit from it, what are the rules, how it will work. I don't see how residents will benefit from this. It seems to me that, uh, especially uh, because I think three businesses have already uh, put in their permit uh, applications for this, that it's only to benefit commercial. One local business owner says this could be a positive for his business. The answer is yes, qualified. As long as it's, in, as long as it's enforced correctly and, uh, and it's patrolled correctly by the city. The finer details of the proposal still need to be hashed out in future meetings. This includes start and end times and what drink cups would be allowed outdoors. This is just the beginning for the proposed DORA in Carmel. It was referred to committee for further input and discussion. I'm Danielle Zulkowski for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook for updates.